what do you have to say about that misguided that misguided view of who we are as a people? You know, how do you, how, how how would you address that for those who see South Chicago and all they see is decay? What do you have to say about that? Well, be, see, they, anybody that came, if I was an outside observer and I would come to anybody, I said, "What the hell is going on?" You have to be here to really understand the beauty of what we experience. We were able to walk in, in the early years. You were able to walk from Houston Avenue all the way down in the summertime, and everybody would be on their porches, and you would walk up from one end of the commercial this way, back this way. There was taverns everywhere. There was taverns. There. It was a vibrant, vibrant, happy kind of a thing because everybody had money, you know. And we were very fortunate to be able to share that experience because it was it's nothing compared to what it is now, nothing. It was, it was beautiful, beautiful. That's why a lot of us feel that our community it might not come back to the way we originally wanted, but we want to leave a legacy that says, you know what, this was beautiful and it will continue to be that way because we're, we're not going to let it fall because we have too much to give through the music, through our art, through the poets, through the, through the, through the technicians of what you're doing now with the movie. I mean, it, it, we have a lot to say of what this neighborhood was about. And we're examples on this extent because I'm doing the sculptures that I did for the steel mills at Steelworkers Park. Uh, I got artwork all over Chicago, but I'm never more prouder than when I do work here in this community because this community is long over. That's why the, the studio that I have right now, 93, is so important because it shows that we're alive. We're, we're hanging in there. Uh, Under the Bridge Studios has already been in existence for five years. And that was the first gallery that ever existed in, in, in South Chicago in the East Side. And it is, and even now that we're not able to have anything functioning there, we're still paying the rent there because it's too important to let it go because they're already playing a very important role in what's going on in South Chicago. We're art history now of, of South Chicago. And it's very, very important for us to keep this, this, this momentum alive as much as we possibly can because... Uh, as you notice, you had an opportunity to go downstairs to my studio. I mean, I'm a man that has almost 900 paintings. Not counting my sculptures. On sculptures, I have hundreds and hundreds of sculptures that I've done. So, so I'm leaving uh, uh, somebody that you could say in South Chicago. I knew Roman, and I'm going to follow Roman's example. Like your grandfather in the music, and your, and your, actually your, your, the, the Gomez family. I mean, I mean we're, le we're leaving a legacy. No matter what, nobody's going to forget us. You know, we're... You can say, oh, no, no, no. Hey, South Chicago. Let me say South Chicago. Roman. <laughs>